Hey, what's up, guys? So uh, I had this idea uh, in Gladiator Beast, which uh, hopefully you will be able to see in this duel. Um, so uh, we're going to be trying out this deck, and uh, basically what it does is it uses Creature Slot plus Test Ape, um, and it's a really, really good combo. Um, ooh, that is quite good. Um, fortunately, I don't know what he is playing, and I can't really War Chariot that. Um, I can, however, Future Fusion and... But, you know, Bestiary is kind of in our deck right now. Um, so we can summon this and then uh, just attack. Or we can uh, we can uh, tag up for Darius and get back another target. And we can exceed with that. But uh, we're just going to go with this. Uh, just because I want to put Bestiary back into the graveyard, essentially, with Future Fusion. So Zephyros. Okay, so we're going to top deck him. And uh, we're just going to remove it right now. Let's see. And you cannot veil her because we are in battle phase. So we are, uh, then we could act, we could do a lot of different things. Um, we're going to go ahead and activate Future Fusion. And we are going to send some things to the graveyard. So we will be sending, uh, well, we have to reveal absolute, or whatever we want. Um, but it's going to be that and this. Too. Oh, where's our, uh, what's he hiding? Oh, there he is. There's person. And that will be Great Tornado. And then we could just set our D prison just because um, I do not want to get heavy stormed. Um, I'm not really too afraid of any effects right now because uh, I'm still unsure what deck he's running. Let's see what he can uh, do right now. I wish you could. Uh, Future Fusion dies. Two tokens, which is fine. So we can uh, do normal summon. That's fine. So we normal summons glow up bolt, which I I don't really like to do, um, but you know what happens. I also have a lot of options here. Um, I can uh, fusion. I can uh, blow up if I want to do that, which I probably will be doing. Um, and then, uh, so we're going to activate Prisma's effect, and then we will send our uh, best area to the grave. And then we can pop two this way, we can still tag out. Um, but I want to see if he uh, wants to Veiler first. So, uh, we are going to make geysers here. <coughs> so we're going to activate the effect of geysers here. Oh. Okay, and uh, we could still activate our creeping ground here. And, uh, Pretty much you can make Roach right here, and uh, that will put our uh, opponent here in a bad situation because uh, um, I can add a card, which is probably what I'm going to be doing. Um, okay. He gets to add 240 back. 
Okay. There he goes. So we're going to uh, tag this out. Extra. And we will tag out for two cards, which will be our Darius. And we will tag out for Red Yari. An attack position. And then we can tag out Herc. Well, I'm going to remove this first. And uh, we're going to tag out LaCroix here. I mean, we could make a Herc clean us if we wanted to. But I don't really like him too much now. I don't really get him off too often. Um, but uh, yeah, we're going to tag out for Equest over here. And uh, since plants really do like to synchro so much, um, we're going to go ahead and make a a uh, roach so we will overlay and we will make a roach here and like glads can make roach really easy um, yeah so pretty much we can end it right here we'd set call if we wanted to but, uh, plants can't do anything against roach and I don't remember if I selected a target for Darius I don't think I did, but it's cool. I didn't didn't even need it. <laughs> That's okay. Gladiator beasts aren't really tier one anymore. <laughs> Going to send let's see what, what he send plague spider perhaps okay so it's not like sending war chariot would do much sending call onto would be good would have been good though um, go for Brianak here which uh, would kind of hurt just a little bit. See, if he makes Guy Knight, though, that'd be a pretty good card. Uh, oh, he is going for Brynak, as I expected. Uh, let's see if he attacks with it. Okay. So, we're putting this back to our hand. It looks like he's playing a variant of Quasar. Um, but pretty much now, it's like, yeah, I have Deep Prism plus I have Chariot, so... Pretty much I'll have answers to everything, unless he draws heavy. Oh, that's another great card. Uh, it works really well in GBs. I actually like that card a lot. Um, uh, I really need an answer for the Brynak, to be honest, if he heavies. And so that's why I'm going to be setting all that. Um, which will be kind of unfortunate that I'll have to do, but... We are going to War Chariot that. And Brynak will be very sad. So he's playing a Quasar deck. Um, I can tell because he's running this card, <laughs> and that card as well. Um, fusion, okay. You can remove a Earth. Let's see what else he removes. And, okay, so it's, it's an Earth and an E-Hero. So he's going to go for Gaia, and um, so it's halved, uh, and we will deprison that, and then pretty much from here, it's going to be game. I don't know if he has anything good in the graves that needs to be removed. He does have a light and a dark, though. Um, but it's okay. <laughs> we'll just go for Darius. And this time we will actually use Darius's effect, because I believe I forgot last time. But uh, and when he had Dark Hole, it honestly didn't matter anyways. Um, I like to keep Bestiary in Grave, so I'm going to special summon another Darius. <laughs> and then we can uh, overlay. And whoops, I don't want to show him that. Oh, there we go. And yeah, I do play two Roaches, uh, just because GBs can get out Roach so easy. And, uh, 
I'm not worried if he top decks Heavy Storm at this point, because top decking Heavy Storm won't really do any good. Um, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> but anyways, thanks for watching, guys. Unfortunately, we didn't get to uh, activate any of these. Oh, it was the next two cards we were going to draw into. Uh, <laughs> so, the idea of this deck, though, was to incorporate Test Ape into GBs, because if I activate Creature Swap on Test Ape, okay, take, I can take their monster, and then I would attack into my own test tape. Test tape would then die. Then I would get a GB, and then the GB could still attack because it's still the battle phase. So that was my idea behind the deck. But uh, anyways, I don't think his hand was that bad. He had Dark Hole, and he was able to synchro. I just believe that making Brynak maybe wasn't the best solution, especially against GBs just because of Chariot. Um, but yeah, if you let GBs attack you, which he did kind of allow me to do. Um, but that, that's the point of Quasar Drek. There's really no, like, back row as far as protection. Basically, you just get out your Quasar Dragon, and then you win. But uh, anyways, thanks for watching, guys. Asian White Dragon, signing out.